What's up guys, it's your boy Triple here. And the other night I was playing um, PlayStation with my cousin. Most likely this gameplay. Um, he vests me, he's the Chicago Bulls. And I am the Lakers for one reason and one reason only. I don't know about you guys, but <clears throat> I don't have a favorite basketball team per se, but I do have a favorite player, and that is Dwight Howard. Um, before he signed, uh, he got traded. Uh, to the Lakers, he was in Magic, so I went for the Magics. Uh, they were pretty good when Vince Carter and Dwight Howard was playing together. Uh, the reason why I, why Dwight Howard is my favorite player is because. Um, Back in 2009, I think, he won the slam dunk competition, and I said, who is this man who won the slam dunk competition, wearing that cape like he's Superman, the black Superman of basketball history, um, and all that, I thought to myself, yep. Move away, Steve Nash. Um, Dwight is my favorite player now. Um, and I follow him around like there's no one's business. Even if he's in the crappiest team in the NBA, I'm still there by him. And... When I say he's my favorite player, he is my favorite player. So when I heard the news that he got signed, he got he got traded to Miami. I had to move to Miami. Uh, sorry, got traded to Lakers. I had to say okay, since Dwight's there, I want to be a fan of the Lakers and I'm like wow this is going to be super cool because Miami has Chris Bosh, LeBron James and Dwayne Wade the three kings of the so-called NBA but now they have a little bit of competition with Dwight Howard and Steve Nash and Kobe and then I think a few weeks later I heard the news that Dwight has signed up to uh, to the Rockets and then I'm like oh man this sucks the Lakers had a chance to have awesome battles with Miami because they have the Free Kings and the Lakers have like the up and coming Free Kings. But now it's basically since Dwight's gone, I'm like, they have no chance. Uh, well, they do have a chance because Kobe hogs the ball. And that's the other reason why I'm like, yeah, yes, I'm so glad that Dwight signed up to Houston because um, it's going to be Shaq and Kobe all over again. Kobe hogging the ball and not passing it to his center. And basically, Dwight's there for no reason. Um, but I'm still like, okay, that's good. Uh, Steve Nash and Kobe will help each other. 
set plays, pick plays <coughs> with each other. Um, sorry. Um, but back on topic, uh, Dwight Howard, my man, my my favorite player in the NBA has moved to has signed up and moved to the Houston Rockets and I'm like yes finally he can be himself he can dunk wherever he wants to like he's he's there um, no one hogging the ball and I s- I said to myself, fantastic, because uh, Jeremy Lin is in, in is in the Houston Rockets, so they will tear it up by themselves. And that's the reason why I chose Dwight, uh, the Lakers, because in this game, I think they updated it, Dwight moved to the Lakers in the NBA 2K13. Um, they have to update it again, of course. But I'm I'm glad that Dwight is moved to a team that has not got many power players. It's only Jeremy Lin. Yeah, that's the only power player that they have in the Houston Rockets. And Dwight, being in the Houston Rockets, can dominate and might make it to the playoffs next season. So, I do not have a favorite team. Um, I think I win this game. But I do have a favorite player, and that's kind of confusing when I just said, uh, I'm talking gibberish now, but um, I win this game, uh, GG Cousin, um, he's the, he's the boss, because Michael Jordan's in it. So I'm like, yeah, clock's winding down, he misses the shot, I win. Um, it's been your boy, boy, rate, comment, favorite, like, peace out.